and I'm just gonna chill out today. I'm getting a bit tired, a bit irritable, and getting a bit lonely. I had some, I was about to like cry yesterday, but I wasn't feeling the best. Hey you! Hello beautiful people! My name is Savannah, but I'm Erin and I go by Savvy C, and welcome or welcome back to Savvy C Scoop. Your girl's last chick to see. Ay, 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 ay. And so I'm staying here in this four bed one more night. I'm gonna fully explore Zagreb today. So come along with me. Let's go. I will see. Hey! I'm not gonna lie to you guys, Zagreb was dead. You hear me? Oh my goodness. To be a capital city, I just knew there'd be more, but this was the highlight by far. Something you must do if you come, Museum of Broken Relationships. It's full of items that have been donated from people all across the world, and they have like little signs like this that explain the significance of it. And it's just showing love, relationships, the good, the bad, the highs and lows of it. You'll laugh, you'll cry, you'll get angry full range of emotions i really love my time there but stay in zagreb one to two nights top <laughs> and then you know take day trips from there and go elsewhere this one was heartbreaking but just reminder that life is beautiful and you should treasure your relationships well that was absolutely lovely oh my goodness i was like crying a little bit i was like i got these shades on uh highly recommend 10 10 stars 10 to recommend five stars life is beautiful and our relationships i remember i told someone about this i was like called the museum of broken relationships he's like aren't all relationships broken? i was like ooh, Andy. which i think to an extent but also relationships make our lives fuller richer more rounder and just incredible so it was really cool highly recommend and it's not all just like romantic lovey-dovey it's like really heartbreaks it's war it's friendships it's everything in between so i try to capture that as best i can but of course you could come see it for yourself and so i'm gonna explore well, I think this is like quote unquote old town, um, like a historic district of Zagreb. And yeah, I think it's the place. Like I said before, stay here one, two days max or do what I did and have this be kind of your rest city if you're long term traveling. Perfect to catch up on rest, catch up on sleep, just chill. You can walk around. This is the main square that you can get off right at the metro or the tram, I guess. It's above ground. Really chill, though. Good food. Uh, just nothing too, quote unquote, significant. <laughs> no shade. You know, we need cities that are, quote unquote, boring. It's nice. So it's a nice pace. But yeah, just two nights and then head to the coast. Good flash flood. I mean, my goodness. I was gonna bring my umbrella today too, but I checked what I was like 25, sunny. That's good. Sorry. Sorry. It's on here. I forgot to film lunch. Now I've just been walking around. There are, or there is, there are two more museums I could go to. Nikola Tesla, and I didn't go to that one in Belgrade, which I should have gone to because he's are being blue. And Museum of Hangovers, but I you know. I'm like, eh, I might as well just say see. Go for it and just kind of chill so might do hangovers but i kind of want to do that alone you know that's another thing about solo travel we talk for a second that there's something you just want to do with someone else like if you do it solo it's like okay but it's like i might as well just save that money and it's like sight people for you so that's one of those things where it's like doing the hangover museum be fun with someone from the group but by myself i'll make it do the same so we shall see clutch and even better i'm on the bottom bunk to the top bunk today pro tip befriend the hostel staff that might be over for, overly friendly but just don't be an asshole be nice be cool good vibes they might give you a little discount extend to stay and they'll more than likely be in the same room and then ask your preference to bed so just a little little pro tip gave them the day. so now i'm gonna regroup for a second make up my bed and then get to work. Get to work. Earlier is post. I did my work earlier today, which was great, so while doing laundry. And now I'm gonna start. Hey! Oh my god! I'm gonna go pet him. Oh my god! Your dog is so cute. I'm so sorry. What's his name? What's his name? I 
made to splits and already this is much more my vibe than Zagreb. Don't recommend going to Zagreb. Only go there for like a night tops if you're traveling through. But yeah, it was, it was a little off. Vibes there were a bit off. But it was good to catch up on work and you know, catch up on sleep, all that good stuff. But now I'm here at the bus station all by myself. Everyone has left. And it was a good and bad idea to take the latest bus because I got here at five and I can, the earliest I can check in is at 11 and it's currently 521. So I got five hours to do only God knows what. But yeah, but I'm excited. I think it'll be good. And people that I met in Zagreb are also here right now. So I'm gonna meet up with them later. And I'm just gonna chill out today. I'm getting a bit tired, a bit irritable, and getting a bit lonely. I had some, I was about to like cry yesterday, but I wasn't feeling the best. And I think it was just hitting me of like, dang, I'm really like, I around myself, which you know, naturally happens. Um, and so I think it's just time for me to just like rest and chill and be present versus like working and like thinking ahead and planning and all this other stuff. So, so yeah, that's what I think today. <laughs> nice and clean and i'm the first one in the room which is always great unpacked change little fit chick and debut in the new shoes hopefully i don't you know hurt myself jesus and going to meet up with some friends i met while in Zagreb at the beach so that's what's in store for today as i said earlier split was far more my vibe i didn't plan for it and i don't think you should either if you're down to just swim in the ocean have some good food, party vibe. If not, I highly recommend then doing like a sail Croatia type vibe or kind of rent a car and go throughout the country. I think that's best for you to have some structure, but it was fun. Just got to have some good food, good drinks, dip my feet in the water a little bit and just relax, which was nice and much needed. Well, like she pretty. This reminds me a lot of Trieste in Northern Italy, right on the border next to Slovenia. Ah, beautiful day. You know, I'm a cancer baby, so I love the water. And it's almost cancer season. It's very, so very exciting. And now I'm about to go meet up with my new fun friends from the Netherlands. So, I have to go do that. Updates. I found them. They're over there. <laughs> now I'm really regretting that gave to some suit yesterday. But I had to grind, I had to do my work, but it's okay. And so I don't think that water warm enough. They had split reviews on if it's warm or cold, so definitely by grease. I'll be in somebody's water. And I found a place on the walk here that does eyebrow threading, manicures, pedicures. So we're gonna crank that out tomorrow. And then find someone to do my hair. I'm gonna do like a little twist so it's easy. And I get a bikini and hopefully a wax. Oh, but I might just shave, that'll be good here. But yeah, very nice, very nice. I'm vlogging, don't mind me. No? You gonna say hi to the vlog? Did you, are you going to Zagreb? Yeah, I am. I'm going the next. Okay, yeah. I'll do a skydiving there. Oh, yeah. nice. Morning. Did you guys hear that? Oh, it's gone. A little thundering. I don't think it's going to lightning quite yet, but it's starting to, or not starting to rain. It is pouring down rain. And then the split. So, it's going to be an indoor day, which is good. Get some stuff done, be productive. Last night was crazy. <laughs> Just stuff and just like, bro, like, I'm gonna look back at this time, like, <laughs> five, ten years from now and be like, bro, what was going on? <laughs> Not with me though, but it was, ugh. That's <laughs> the last. Last night was fun. Made it, home, made it back to 
him. The hospital safe and sound, made a home safe, all good. Slept so well, slept in today, which was much needed. And yeah, now I'm just gonna chill um, and just do work all day today and book. I'm going to Bosnia tomorrow. So, Sarajevo, the capital of Bosnia, and Herazanga. They just dropped the second part. They used to be like Bosnia, Sarajevo, Mustafa, wherever you're going. So, I'm going to Sarajevo tomorrow. So, I'm gonna get that booked up of like Flexbus ticket and hostel bookings. Can't do that. And then, yeah, it's still a work day. So, this is not gonna be as fun as yesterday was. But yesterday was so much fun. So, it's cool. So, yeah, that's what we're getting into today. Hello, beautiful people. Ironically enough, I am full circle. I was just over there Sunday morning for several hours, and now I'm here, <laughs> on the other side, right by the water. About to leave Miss Bullet, and I've decided, I made the executive decision last night, but formally decided this morning, that I'll not be going to Dubrovnik, at least this time around, because it is way too expensive. I've talked to so many people, and they're telling me, just these prices say, oh, so oh, la la. I would love to see King Lee. I'm a Game of Thrones girl, savvy Stark, gang, you but not for that, honey. Not for that price. So, my last Croatian city, at least for now, I can always come back. You know, maybe I come back and I'll be, you know, on one of those. Take me out to the ride on a yacht. You feel me? So, so yeah, so now I'm going to Sarajevo, which is the capital of Bosnia. And it's almost one. We leave at 1.30 and it's about five hours, fifteen minutes, because you have 14 stops and border control. So I don't think it'll be that far of a journey, but just a lot of stopping and starting and we take a break halfway through. So I have my podcast downloaded, my food, and you ready? It's you see. Even have drinks here. Yeah, they have like a <laughs> restaurant. It's great. I'm most our tier list. It's about just under two hours train ride. Beautiful. 10 10 recommend. Beautiful. Thanks for watching. As always, I'm sending my love to wherever you are in the world where you're watching this. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.